おはようございます。Today I'm gonna watch a video called Kids Try Snacks from Japan. I'm really looking forward to seeing what kind of Japanese snacks they'll try and how the kids in different countries will react to them. I hope they'll all like it. Okay, let's start it. <laughs> My nail. Your nail. It's very big. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> So cute. Kids try snacks from Japan. Okay, let's see. Next one, we're trying more snacks. <laughs> nice gesture. Konnichiwa, everyone. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Oh, Japan. Okay, they all know what konnichiwa means. That's great. I, I want to scream. May I? Sure. <laughs> Nice scream. Right, uh, you right. just killed my ear. <laughs> Umai bo! Yeah! I used to eat those when I was a kid. Oh, that's Japanese! I know it! So, you have two snacks there. They're different flavors. Yeah, what, uh, what is the flavor? Good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yum. Yeah, I'm okay. Mm. I'm really glad to hear that. <laughs> so what flavor is the other one? Spicy. Nice. It's teriyaki flavor. Teriyaki flavor, yeah, that's a pretty good I wonder why cool they challenge. make it like what they not taste like. Well, it's supposed to be a teriyaki burger. So not like a hamburger. Yeah, true. The other one is pizza flavor. Pizza mm. flavor, yeah, that flavor is my favorite too. <laughs> Hello. Nice reaction, yeah. <laughs> How's it? It's a spicy pizza. Oh, really? No, okay. thank you. No, thank you. Oh, oh my god. Bowl. Could you said to hear Umai it. Bo? Yeah. What does umain bo mean? Delicious stick. Oh. Delicious stick, yeah, true. The one that's at the top wins. Teriyaki is the winner! Oh, okay. It's no exaggeration to say that umaibo is the most famous snack in Japan, especially very popular among kids. And in addition to the flavors shown here, there are about 20 different flavors, and you can buy it for only 10 cents each. Really cheap, right? By the way, I like comptage flavor and cheese flavor also, so why don't you try out various flavors when you come to Japan? Oh, Kinoko no Yama! This is one of my favorite snacks too! And actually, this is not Kinoko no Yama. It's Kinoko no Yama. Yum! Let me open it! Pencils! Can I open it, Tundia? Ooh! So, I'm gonna call these the mushroom popsicle. <laughs> mushroom popsicle. <laughs> They're just a broad nice stick name. with charcoal on it. That's all. Mm, yes, dark true. chocolate. In Japan, chocolate is usually a little less sweet. Chocolate, chocolate, the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. Kinoko. Kinoko? No. No. Yama. 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 Kinoko means mushroom. Yama means mountain. Yes. Mushroom mountain. Hmm. Whoever sent this to us, right choice to send these. I think it's great to see you. No one sent these to us. <laughs> Kinoko no Yama is also a very popular snack in Japan, but it has a fatal rival called Takenoko no Sato. It means bamboo village in English, and for years consumers have been arguing over which one is better. In Japan, this battle has become such a hot topic, and it was called Mushroom Bamboo War. And in a survey conducted by Meiji in 2019, Kinoko no Yama won after four months of voting. So when you come to Japan, try to compare which one you like better. Yeah, card. Mm. It is my favorite snack too. Mm. <laughs> you like it? They taste exactly the same as Cheeto Puffs. So these are called Curl, aka Curl. Yeah, Curl. They're seeds. For Caroline. 
Carolina. <laughs> for Carolina. <gasps> oh, an S. <laughs> As for Simon? As for Simon, okay. I don't know. Are you okay? Just kidding. <laughs> Karu is also very tasty and famous snack in Japan, but past few years its popularity has declined and it's only sold in Western Japan. So I can't buy it anymore. It's very sad. Yeah, fair lemonade. Very nostalgic. It's a teeny toy! Oh, okay. Teeny toy. So it's actually not edible, it's a prize. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna get some more candy. One for you, one for you. <laughs> okay, so Maddox, these candies are special. Hold it up to your mouth and blow into it. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> so cool, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Man, it's so I love it. Don't eat me. Don't they have like mentoses? Yeah, they're not mints, so they don't like it. Alright, you play song. What is it? I know what it is. Hmm. Jingle bells. No. Oh, really? It's oh. Batman smells. What? <laughs> oh, yeah, you will. In Japan, there are many types of snacks called dagashi, such as fueramune. This is general name for inexpensive snack made for kids, and you can buy it around 5 to 30 cents. And even dagashi bar exists in Japan where you can drink alcohol while eating them. So it might be a good idea to visit there when you come to Japan. Yeah, ramune! Every kid in Japan has had this juice at least once. Yum! No, that's cold. Ooh. How do you open this actually? Yeah. Actually, it's kind of tricky to open it. Yeah, <laughs> it's really hard, right? Yeah. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> What does it do today? The marble seals it, and you just release the marble. Cheers. How's it? It tastes like a flavor that I've never had before. This oh. is the, you know the flavor? The... Flavor? It's uh, basically... I know what you're trying to say. That's kind of like the original I don't flavor, know right? what you're yeah. trying to say. So that flavor is called Ramune. Ramune. Yeah. Derived yeah. from lemonade. Oh, nice. Yeah, I miss ramune so much. I probably haven't had it in about 20 years. By the way, all the kids struggled to open it and that's because top of the bottle was covered with marbles. So you have to push hard with the cover. I remember I couldn't open it well either when I was a kid. And in Japan, they have a lot of candy that's that flavor. So I brought you one to try. No. Okay. Yeah, this is one of dagashi. Oh, it tastes like yogurt. I really want to put this in. Uh -huh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> because marbles is inside there. Well, <laughs> you said you guys like these snacks in Japan. Yeah. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, yeah. Wow. I'm really glad to hear that. Thank you for watching Kids Try Snacks from Japan. And don't forget to subscribe. Sayonara. <laughs> Sayonara. It was very interesting and kids were so cute and adorable in this video. And also, I am so glad that kids all love Japanese snacks. Anyway, thank you very much for watching guys. See you soon. Bye bye.